Okay, so this is the room that we're going to be transforming. Has he gone? Boo! What? You don't like them? I'm actually not very good at DIY. Blast through with this electric drill. <laughs> Transforming video. Sorry, I jumped in. Go on, Bill. Today we Room have a transformation. You're like a little before. Uh, one of those little birds. What After peacock, woodpecker. I knew exactly what you meant. No, I was thinking like a goose and a goat. You know, Ew. but you're like a, a yeah, goose. a woodpecker. A woodpecker's a bird. I was thinking like a big goose, like a big bird with a long neck, and then go. Uh -huh. A woodpecker's a bird. I was thinking of a big bird. A big bird. <laughs> oh, I love a bird. Okay, big bird. Okay, that was a great start to the video. Um, today we're going to be doing a room transformation of this room that we are in. And you ride them, like people ride them. Um, it's just a bit harsh. A, pe a peacock. Uh, yeah, no. You don't ride a peacock. A, um, one of you the big ones, and they have the black kind of like feathers, and then they have the pinky neck, and they got a big beak. And they, mm, you don't ride like, a bird. No, they do. It's like they, you see it in a movie. That's how they do it in a movie, and they uh, and they do that. And they're in zoos. What's the bird called, guys? We gotta go. Okay, so this is the room that we're going to be transforming. It is one of our guest rooms, and it's a little bit of an awkward shape. It kind of goes round the corner here. Uh, which we fitted with, and then we don't have much space, so this is the best angle I can yeah. get. We fitted some massive IKEA wardrobes where James keeps his stuff. This is my room. This Ooh. is where I'm gonna I'm gonna keep all my stuff, and it looks a bit empty at the moment. Go on, Bill. I need to buy more clothes to fit it, guys. <laughs> it's got massive <laughs> wardrobes and hardly any clothes. <laughs> yep. Um, and then it just kind of goes around the corner here and has the bed. And we've got, so this is a double bed. This is the bed we got from Arista, which we talked about in the last video. And we've got space for some little bedside tables. Um, we just want to make the room just... More inviting. You know, yeah. yeah. We just want to make transform it. New light shades and pictures, a mirror, a shelf. A curtains, We're going to... Curtains, curtains uh, a throw, pillows, all of that jazz to transform this into a gorgeous guest room. That's what we're doing today. Bye, Nina. See you later, puppy. Bye, bye. You're my best friend. Didn't care about the rules, good on the weekends I'll be in fools, drifting the deep Okay, so we're on our way to Denham. Uh We thought we would do uh, initial sort of look around Denham because they've got loads of good curtains basically well, yeah and they're really good for curtains and it's the closest place to us and probably where we'd get most of the stuff anyway yeah. at the end of the day Denham just has yeah. everything and I know I've seen some bedside tables there that I really like because the space beside each bed is really small and we couldn't decide could we whether to push the bed right up against one side and yeah, have a bigger space or whether guests would prefer tighter two, spaces each side two bedside tables rather and than two bedside, bedside tables table. and only small bedside tables but Probably it's one of those, like the person who does have the bedside table. Would prefer. <laughs> yeah, that's so true. <laughs> that would be me squished up against the wall yeah. and you with the bedside yeah. table. That probably is true. Okay, guys, so we're in Denelm. We've already found some curtains that we love, which we think are curtains the exact. Are so expensive, guys. Curtains are. It's quite sad. Really, the bane of our life, really, it's in this new house. Like I know, our, our windows are oh so my big. Gosh, I didn't see you pick this up. Yeah, oh, I was just going to show it to Look you. Look at this. Home oh, is worth a Wi Fi connection. Look, I thought this would and be you good. Put your passwords? Yeah, I thought it would be good oh, for the guest such a room. Good idea. Oh, no, we could put it in the hall. So when people come in, they can see it. Yeah, could do. That'd be really cool. Yeah, because we always have it written on the back of the little like yeah. Wi-Fi thing, and I'm like, just go and look at the little the back oh, of the thing. Right. Whereas I can just say it's on the little I love thing. That. That's uh, a I know. Idea. Love it. Um, and then we've also got a black curtain pole. As you guys know, I'm kind of going for like a black sort of feature theme in the new house. I want like loads of little black touches. So I thought a black curtain pole That'll with last some. Bill, it won't. It's just, I love it. I do love the thing. Just ignore him. I do love the thing. Trying to get it going. Thank you. Let's go and look at the um, side tables you like. <gasps> yes, the bedside tables. Okay, so this was the bedside table that I had my eye on because it's really small and it will fit perfectly on either side and it kind of follows with the touch yeah. of kind of black theme. I'm not um, sure. I, I, I think it's navy, but apparently it's I know. It does look a bit navy slash grey. But I feel like it'll go quite nicely without being too harsh. I like it, but I don't love it. Oh, okay. But there's such a little option, isn't there? I know. The size we want. So I've also found something else. I'm going to take okay. James there now. It's in the bathroom please, section. Please okay, so here they are. This is strange though, it's in I the was, bathroom section. It is strange it's in the bathroom section, but open mind, Boo, okay? okay? It was meant to be a bathroom storage thing, but I feel like they could work really well as cute little bedside tables. And they've got black buttons. Um, Is he gone? Boo! What? them oh they're so cute you 
you don't like the pattern on them, should've known. Should've known, guys. Doesn't like fussy patterns. Just... He likes plain and simple. No, boo, anything's gonna be rickety that's like that small and cheap. Same with Ooh, nothing, you know? It's got a phone call. Okay, so James convinced me to not rush my bedside table decision. I feel yes. like I was getting a bit carried away uh, well, we with pop, choosing we one of the- down tomorrow, can't we? Yeah. You know? So we thought we'd go to our fave place, Home Sense, um, and check out what's there. We always, whenever we're doing like a room transformation or anything, we always kind of go to Home Sense to check that there's not anything better in Home Sense because yeah. we just love Home Sense so much. So we're gonna go there now. We've already purchased the curtains and the curtain rail because we love those, um, but we don't want to rush any decisions for the new house. So we're gonna go to Home Sense now and check it out. And then where we've just been is literally two seconds from our house. So um, we can go back there tomorrow if we don't find anything that we like in Home Sense. Maybe we should check out some other He's shops. Peeping. I can never yeah, I know. Shops. And then nothing's really as good as Home Sense in Denham anyway, so you better off just. Exactly. It's a waste. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da -da. What home sense? <laughs> so we're really struggling with bedside tables, but we found a couple yeah. of cute lamps. There's not really. Any I quite like these. Yeah, they're nice because they've got like the sort of neutral vibes. That we yeah, and then black. black, and the gold just um, adds a bit, you know. You know, I, mean, I think that could work well. Neutral gold and black. But then it depends what, because if we went to those black bedside tables, they then would like merge from black into black. Yeah, that's true. It depends what bedside tables you go for. So you need the bedside tables. Yeah, so it's like, I know. What are you going for here? Okay guys, so we've been quite successful so far. We found the lamps that we love. We then found this throw for the bed, which we love because it's mostly neutral with some black touches and then those kind of go really nicely. And then we also found this lamp, which we're obsessed with, which we don't even know where it's gonna go in the house, but it's gonna go somewhere. in our bedroom, so we'll yeah. see. We wanna steal it for our own bedroom. Yeah. Look how cute the detailing know, is. It's nice, isn't it? <gasps> love it. But I don't know what to do with the bedside table now because I would avoid black. Mm. What about a wood? Like a wood, yeah. yeah. Like a basic wood mm. or... Yeah. Should we look upstairs? They might have something. Have a little look. Yeah, have right. a little look. Movies, how it's gonna stay in the fight with you. Just thinking we would do this until we could. Okay, so we're finally done getting all the stuff. James has just brought look at these tools. Look at this. Such a man. You are going to man tools. Just get my belt on, you know, my tool belt and <laughs> your tool belt. Oh. Yeah, I'll be the one doing all the screwing, yes. let's be honest. Okay. Let's be honest now, James. Uh, okay, so we've got everything here. Go on with your tape measure. Um, that we want to put up. I'm honestly so happy with everything we got. I feel like it couldn't have gone better. Yeah, I think it did really well. well. I just really hope it all comes together really nicely. And uh, I, to be honest, if it does, I feel like it's going to be better than I imagined. Yeah. I I'm so excited. I'm so excited to get it all up. Okay, what should we start with? Curtains, bedside tables. Oh yeah, we didn't show you what we got. We actually got shelves. We're gonna attempt to put these up now. We gave up, we're trying to find a bedside table. The one that we liked in Denelm, which was the black kind of similar one to our console table was actually, <laughs> James just hurt himself opening the packaging. Um, Such a man. Was sold out uh, and they didn't have two of the same one. They didn't even have one. So we just kind of gave up. We didn't want to rush buying anything, bought some shelves and we thought bish bash bosh, shelves, lamps, boom. We're gonna put those up now. Okay, so we did buy some screws earlier because so much of the stuff needs screws, all the shelves, um, the curtain pole, everything needs screws. We bought a massive pack of screws and we think that we put them down in the shop before we actually got to the till. So James has had to go back out and get all the screws that we need, which is so annoying because he spent ages looking for the exact screws that we needed for everything. Um, and we must have put them down before we even got to the till, which is just, don't know how that happened. So I'm gonna stay here and do some small things like change the duvet and do all those kind of things until James gets back. <laughs> James and his tools and he forgot his tools <laughs> <laughs> after all that. So we're all here now and we're going to put up the shelf that I ordered a little while ago onto this wall here. And um, we need to get it a good height so it's like going to be under a mirror and kind of where people can put like a wash bag or just something and have a little vase on there yeah, as well. It's so it's going to be cute. I'm actually not very good at DIY and I've just been randomly making holes 
Not the screw doesn't stay in. Look at the hole over there. I told James this was his Look punishment. There we go. My punishment is to say that Karis is the master of be it, of DIY. Oh, true. And um, I can't do anything. Uh, yeah. So James with his DIY toolkit comes to in. Fair, Karis, we show everything. So Blast. It's our DIY toolkit. Blast. I'm covering three other holes, guys, <laughs> under here. Blast <laughs> through with his electric drill. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, oh, I give up! Nothing works! James, go over there, do those small shells. <laughs> oh, I give up! Nothing works! So I Honestly. think this punishment's going a bit far there now, Paris. I know, I'm really <laughs> taking this on. <laughs> I had to just put that in the wall, not for Yeah, well done. See? So Karis just used an actual <laughs> screwdriver and used kind of effort <laughs> to put it in. That seemed a lot of effort. I took here. a step back and I thought, because James was right, this was creating holes and they were just falling out, the screws were falling out. Don't yawn behind the camera. This is intense, intelligent yeah, yeah, thinking please. by me. Tell us how you screwed this in the screws. This kit holes and then I was like, as he was drilling it in and drilling it back out, it was creating a bigger hole than the screw. So I took a step back, I pondered upon my thoughts and I thought, why? What can we do to create smaller holes? So for anyone who's still watching the vlog, we are going to carry on now doing the room. vlogs over like two or three or four or five days. We're very used moment. to saying that now. It yeah. is now the next day, it's three days yeah. later, it's yeah. two days later. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so last night we kind of just went for it. The sun went down, Yeah. we went to the gym and then we smashed out, back to Dunelm, got some bedside tables, got everything we needed. I went a bit crazy, didn't I? I even like changed, have you got a little kill popping out there, babe? <laughs> What's going on there? Slicking my own hair. Well, Mila's going in the room. But there okay, we go. she's on the bed her with her slobbery ball, mm. so you'll see that any second now. <laughs> um, she's literally got a ball dribbled in slobber. Um, Lovely. Okay, so yeah, yeah, I went a bit mad. I even yeah. got some pictures. I put the black picture frame. It looks frame. amazing. I got the vase, guys. Amazing. Anyone who watched the one where we had the delivery from H&M. Did you see it there? Oh, the yeah, thing? I didn't realise that it. was the vase. <laughs> uh, I got it back out of the box. We'd like done the box up to uh, return quite a bit of the stuff. And I got the vase back out. It, it works perfectly. Good, it does look good. It was a kind of a unique vase yeah. that needed that. Anyway, right, we're going to show you the room now. I'm going to montage it. And then we're going to go and explain what we did. Okay, are you ready for the montage? Here it is. There's a big ring light. Okay, okay. So we're just going to give you a quick chat about where we got everything from. Come on in. Come on in to Mila's bedroom. Do you love your new room? <laughs> no, you love your ball more. Yeah. Okay, so, like I said, you've seen most of the stuff. I went a bit crazy with the bed throws. I couldn't find my perfect scenario, so I've gone for three bed throws. H&M, <laughs> H&M. I'll try and say where things are from. H&M, H&M, We can't sense. really see the first one, but there it is. So it's like a white yeah. one at the bottom, and then Karis has put the home sensor one in the middle, like, taking up most of the bed, and then the black home sensor one on top. I think you like it. You've got a big waggy tail for it. So yeah, the, the colours for the room were white, Black, sort of yeah. greys, neutrals, so the pill the pillows tied in really nicely. I Where think the pillows look lush. That Denelm. was um Denelm. Ooh, Denelm! And it look, it goes really nicely. Yeah, I think they're lush. Um, I actually really like those. I went for the two pillow effect. The pillow and duvet were just mm -hmm. plain white from Denelm. I popped No, they the weren't. The pillow and duvets. Oh, they were from Home Sense. They were from Home Sense. Yeah, Home Sense have great duvets. Home I would definitely best. recommend. Yeah, and they have really good prices, don't yeah. they? Um, this little plant pot. Oh, this I didn't even the, see that. I know. Sneaked in in there, boo. This was from um, H&M and the little plants from Ikea. I think that's strange there, personally. It is. I'm not we'll happy with it. For now, but I just wanted a bit of greenery yeah. in the room, yeah. um, and I just couldn't... I think you need a bit of a higher plant pot, maybe. Exactly. I know? was thinking maybe like a... a tall, thin vase with yeah. some little leaves popping out. That's out. what I would like more, but maybe for another day. Temporary. Um, okay, so the bedside tables, mm -hmm. guys, they were the ones that we found in Dunelm. 
Now this is them back to front, okay? So here we go, let me just open the jar. No, 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 no. Oh wait, no. they're back to front. James really isn't happy about we that. We should do I a pop-up of what they look at the front. Yeah, I'll do a pop-up of a good idea. James is right, they just don't quite look right, but I didn't like them the other yeah, way around. Yeah, they look a bit too, but then why did you paint No, 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 them? I like them the other way around, because I told you I was going to paint them matte black. Yeah, you are going and to. And I still think that would look amazing. They look um, good the way it is, but like... It's just it clear was, that something's not quite right because it's the back of the drawer. I bought them because the pattern matched yeah. this. It was like that yeah. pattern on the front. And it was just too much pattern, pattern, pattern. Yeah. Whereas once I paint it black, I think it'll be less, like more kind of blend in, you know? Yeah, I agree. I think that'll you look know? good. And then we've got the bedside lamps. Faves. Both from um, Home Sense. And they go really nicely in here. I'm Obsessed. chuffed with those. And the <gasps> little piece of art. We couldn't get over how well that went. Like we were looking I for know. a piece of art for ages. And yeah. it literally tied in every colour, didn't it? That comes from Dunelm. So that's put, no, the range. Oh, yeah, from the, the range. range. And this little print we got from Decenio quite a while ago. Yes. Which is an online shop we uh, worked with. And we've got the black frame as well, which we put around it. I think that was also from Decenio, although that one could be from my Yeah, no, the black frame was from Decenio. Was from I took Decenio. it from another photo because originally it had a wooden one and I just felt yeah. like the black tied in. Carlos just wants as much black as possible, really. Well, I like all the black yeah. features. It you does know? go really well. And then we've got our black curtain veil, also from oh. Dunelm, which fits. Perfect, me. So Although we do need to do some wall work when we paint yeah, just we to kind of get rid of the old <laughs> curtain wheel spots. And then the curtains themselves, which were from. Um, Dunelm. Dunelm. Everything's from the curtain Dunelm. shop. Yeah. And then, and then we we've have got our little setup over here. I love this little setup. I just wanted something in the room. The room's not big enough to have like a big dresser or, yep. or a big kind of place where guests can put their stuff. I just wanted, because I know my sister or cousin would stay here. They'd bring a mm -hmm. wash bag, they'd put it there. You want it in front of the mirror, do your makeup. And then I also popped this little thing here, which is something we got in a package once, but we never used. And it's kind of just like That's a cute, little. cute, isn't it? Away we go. Like, yeah. What, what's... It was for a honey. It's, it was called a honeymoon package. So yeah, it's like a little package and it has like lip balm and nail yeah, file in That's stuff, so, so cute. Oh, that's cute. Then you've got your little black. H&M vase there, which we were meant to get rid of. You've got this um, diffuser, which your nan gave us for Christmas. No nope, so wedding good. present. Strong. And then we have this shelf, which you got from Etsy. Someone on Etsy, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Or was it? Was it Etsy? I think it was Etsy. Yeah, yeah. it was Etsy. Um, and it just kind of. It looks really good, and then we had to put the wall bucket on. Although, look, we did make an absolute mess. We wanted to put it further left. We wanted to put it further over here, yeah. like the centre of the bed. Uh, but this is um, hard wall, and that was um, like partition wall or yeah, whatever it's called. And we just couldn't get into it. This is there. the difference. Yeah. And our I'm not wall. sure why that's partition wall. I don't know. As this if there house... used to be a door there. That's so confusing. This house is so strange. They have the yeah. weirdest kind of original yeah. walls, and everyone that's come that's like a builder or whatever says that the walls. Oh, on the exterior yeah. of the house are ridiculously like solid like yeah they think it was built by like an ex-military person and like it's like literally armored and i was like ah. try breaking into our yeah no, that's not a challenge guys please no honestly literally <laughs> but we were trying to drill and that's yeah. literally how far we got yeah it was that we tough. literally couldn't get the drill into the wall. don't get me wrong what? neither of us are professional builders i'm sure a professional builder would get through the wall we just literally were had no chance well the cctv guy had no I problem i snapped the thing didn't i he snapped the drill i did so that was good <laughs> Anyway, um, that's our bedroom. That's the bedroom. Mila's I think we smashed off. that. Mila's room is now sorted. <laughs> Good night. We are going elsewhere to film another video now, Mila. You can stay in oh, here. Oh, the lampshade. Oh, yeah, the lampshade. So we haven't actually fixed this <laughs> lamp yet. But the lampshade, it's difficult to see because the light's actually on. Do you want to turn off for a sec? There we go. So it's actually, it looks a bit creamy, but it's, it is actually white. And we've got that from the range as well. It's like the opposite to the ones we have in the hall downstairs, which are black. And we just need to stick this thing back up there. But we haven't got super glue because it doesn't screw at the moment. This is like a little insight into yeah. how the rest, it's like a sneak peek to the rest of the house. How we want to set it up, isn't it? Kind of, yeah. yeah. The same vibes, but we'll go for a bit different in every room. Yeah. And this is kind of the vibes that we're going for, but also this is so not nearly done still. We need to paint mm -hmm. the walls, we could go a it's little bit different the bathroom we're currently designing, we're doing like blacks and whites and stuff. It's going to be lush. So excited to get that I'm so done. excited. Okay, that is the end of our first Room transformation within the house. First of many, hopefully, but many. the others are going to have to take a little while. Yeah, they do. are doing other bits of work, and it just doesn't make sense to do the other rooms no. until, like, those pieces of work are done because of the dust that's going to create. But we've got we'll some paneling coming on the wardrobe. Board. Oh, yeah, we're just having a wardrobe for today. Yeah, just for now. For now. It's going to look like the IKEA ones, but we're paying no. more. No, 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 it's definitely not, guys. We've got a really cool, like, wood guy doing them, and he's doing He's like, a wood really... guy. No, he is really Pop, good, isn't he? Yeah. And he's doing, like, detailing on. Yeah. Oh. And he's going to do us a new banister, which is going to look incredible. Oh I just want to quickly show that. Actually. Yeah, go on. Because it does seem a bit OTT having a new banister. Here's all our mess, please ignore it. So, we really wanted to open up this space because mm -hmm. we're transforming the stairs. 
and we're going to put a random and stuff more detail coming soon we wanted to like turn this into a banister to kind of open up the space a bit yeah. more so you could actually see through yeah and we know the regulations for it i know some of you guys said previously about the regulations with the we got it. He knew. so it will be very safe for when we have kids yeah. the distances will be good and actually this isn't regulation height at the moment so he's gonna to have to raise it a couple of inches and raise so it. again that would be very safe all sorted, all sorted. don't you worry about that Snap. So that's the end of the vlog from us guys, we hope that you enjoyed watching. We are actually going to go off now and film a non-house vlog. We're going to film oh, our five-year plan, which I'm really excited to do, but we don't know each other's five-year plans, so it's going to be quite, them. quite a fun one. So if you are getting a little bit bored of the house vlogs, the next one won't be a house vlog, but if you just subscribe and turn your notice on, then obviously you'll get a note and it'll tell you the title and you can decide to always <laughs> watch it, because they're all great videos. Go on, we're loving that vlog. Yeah? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Basically, if you did like it, if you did enjoy, leave us a comment below. We love reading your comments, and we'll see you in the next video. We love you so much. I'm so dead. I know. It's we're a really back, we're back to using the big camera because we think the quality's better. Let us know if you think the quality's better because we're using our big heavy camera that Kyle's usually uses for sit downs. I wonder if it's more shaky it's yeah, because it's heavier. Because I'm like, oh. <laughs> love you so much. Bye. Bye.